To use the Hummingbird ventricular, you must have an H200MR kit and an AirPulse AMS patient cable available. Connect the AirPulse AMS patient cable to the patient monitor before beginning the procedure, allowing the transducer to rise to an equilibrium temperature. Position the drill assembly in the tripod, using the tripod to position the drill bit perpendicular to the cranium. Using a drill bit that comes with the kit, drill a hole with an approved surgical technique. Check the drill hole to ascertain that no sharp bone shards exist. Incise the dura. While holding the bolt, advance the ventricular catheter into the ventricle, being aware of the 5 cm diamond mark, and remove the stylet, verifying the catheter's placement into the ventricle. Slide the bolt down the ventricular catheter and place into the twist drill hole. Now advance the bolt and screw in. Stabilize the ventricular catheter to the desired depth by rotating the TUI Borst cap clockwise until the green fills the cap window and the cap cannot be tightened further. For instructions on ICP activation, please refer to Chapter 2. Remove the AMS lure from the air pulse lure. After removing the CSF drainage bag, place the sterile lure cap on the ventricular catheter hub. Rotate the TUI Borst cap counterclockwise to loosen. Remove the ventricular catheter. Turn the bolt counterclockwise to remove it from the skull.